Hello, 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 I'm Laura Laura and today I am going to be doing my favourites as it is the end of the month, um, end of September and I really don't know where September went. Uh, I swear I say that every month. Um, I just can't believe it's nearly October and then it's going to be November, then December, then Christmas, then New Year. Gosh, it's everything seems to be flying by. Anyway, I'm just going to get on with it because I want this to be really quick and I know that I don't have much battery on this camera as I had to panic charge it just before this. So let's just get on with it. Um, this is mostly makeup. Um, I don't know why. I just... I, my skincare routine has been a bit crap recently. Um, sorry, excuse my language. Um, so that I haven't really been using anything different so I'm just gonna get on with it and it is really hot in here and I'm wearing this jumper it's because anyway just gonna get on with it so the first two things are the Rouge Edition Velvet by Bourgeois lipsticks and honestly these are oh, I do, okay they I'm gonna tell you they're in Olay Flamingo 05 and 11 so half pink Okay, and um, they are like, they have a, it's like a lip gloss applicator, and then you put it on your lips, and then it sets matte, and they last, I had this one on this morning, I put it on at about half seven this morning, and I came home at four o'clock, five o'clock, and it was still on my lips, I've just reapplied it for this video, I'm wearing the 11, number 11, so happy pink, uh, on my lips right now, sometimes I can't be bothered to take my makeup off, and if I've been wearing this one especially, I wake up the next morning and mum thinks that I've just applied my lipstick again. Um, honestly, and they are just amazing. I think they're about $8.99, maybe $7.99. Um, really, really worth it, honestly. The, I keep saying honestly. Uh, the longevity, longevity of these is so good. Um, I want to try and get a coral. I don't know if they do one. I'd really, really, really recommend these though. Next thing is my L'Oreal Brow Artist Plumper, which, which is just a brow setting gel. Uh, I think Hello October Susie, also on YouTube, link in the description, um, She, I think she recommended this and I was using the Rimmel one before and it just was nowhere near as good as this. This sets your brows all day long. Um, I've got mine in shade medium dark because I like my eyebrows quite dark as you can see. Um, so I would just really recommend this. I think it's about five pounds and they have clear, like black, medium and light, I think. I would presume so, I think that's four shades. Um, really, really recommend, well, oh, right. <laughs> really, really recommend this um, if you're looking for a new brow setting gel. Even if you don't colour in your um, eyebrows, a brow setting gel is really good for them, just to keep them in place all day. Um, another thing to keep your makeup in place all day is um, the L'Oreal, oh, they're both L'Oreal, I just realised, uh, L'Oreal Infallible Mattifying Base. Whoa, I've used, used loads of this, which is just a primer. I have the foundation, but I got it in a too pale shade, and if you mix it, because it's mattifying, it just goes disgusting and I literally look grey. So, um, I really, really like this. I do use this, obviously, for my foundation, because that's what you're meant to do, and some days I do just... I just dropped it. Um, some days you, I do just wear this by itself, and no foundation over the top. But, um, really, really good. does help your makeup stay, especially if you put it on your eyelids, just when you're, like, uh, blending in. It... I've dropped it again. <laughs> it does help your makeup stay in place. Now the next thing is kind of makeup. Why am I dropping everything? It's the Maybelline Doctor Rescue All-in-One uh, base and top coat. This was in pretty much every magazine that I read through the month of August. I was about to say October. What is going on today? Um, through the month of August. It is so good for repairing your nails as a base coat. My nails are in such bad condition, I don't know why, they're just dry all the time. And this has really, really sorted them out. Um, I don't know how good it is as a top coat. I do use it, um, still chips, but that might be due to the, the cheap, um, bad quality nail varnish. But honestly, if you're looking for a new base coat to repair your nails, I'd really, really recommend this. This is an all-in-one one. You can buy the base coat and the top coat separately. I just bought both for both. The next thing is the Garnier Micellar Water, which I had this before and I've just repurchased it, repurchased it and it 
I'm, I'm really worried that it might be a new formula because I feel as though it's just not as good as it was before but it is still a really good product. I think this big bottle was something like £3, something ridiculous. Um, obviously a great dupe for Bioderma. If you watch other YouTubers I'm sure they go on about this one. I think the simple one's also meant to be good as well. Um, I just really like it and it's pink so... <laughs> Um, yeah, I, I, I use this pretty much every morning and every evening to remove my makeup and to cleanse in the morning when I'm being lazy and don't want to wash my face. The next thing is Sudocreme, a bit of a random favourite and this is because um, from where I haven't been keeping up with my skincare routine, my skin is obviously broken out and this, if you didn't know already, is an amazing spot cream. Um, I think it was... Beauty Crush, Sammy from the Beauty Crush on YouTube uh, recommended this, was it in like Beauty Hacks or something? Um, for healing spots. You put it on your spot the night the night before, you wake up in the morning and honestly your spot will have, it would have gone down, it won't have completely gone but then you just reapply it the next night and then it goes. I don't know what's in this. It's antiseptic healing cream, that's probably why. And it's so cheap, This this I've had this tub for, I think it lasts for years. My next favourite is going to be clothing and it is this jumper that I'm wearing right now. What was that? Um, it's from Topshop and you might have seen it. It just has Austin, Texas, 1979, USA. And it is so soft on the outside. It's, oh, and but on the inside it's like different. It's, it's like it's inside out. You know when you have a jumper and it's, yeah, it's like the inside out. Um, from Topshop, 26 pounds I think and <laughs> the day I bought it, I, well I wore it to school like a couple of days later and everyone knew it was from Topshop and said that they either have it or they want it so um, I would get it before your friends do so they can't get it <laughs> um, I think me and my friends are going to have to share this now <laughs> um, it's really thin yet thick so it keeps, like now I'm really hot but earlier it was, I was freezing cold um, I don't really know but I think layered it will be fine obviously Topshop at the moment is amazing. I can go in every week and pick something that I want to buy. Links to everything that I mentioned in the description below that I can find. Um, I really hope that you liked it. Remember to give it a big thumbs up if you did. Make sure that you subscribe. Like, comment, share, subscribe, everything you always do. I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.